like it was hitting, but it was just like it was it wasn't even hitting. It was like more or less like smacking and punching. Like I wanted to be hit and not like knock me the hell out. You know what I'm saying? There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. Hey you guys, so today's video is another lace wig from RPG Hair. I did get this like right before Christmas or no, after Christmas. So the box is like Merry Christmas, you know, Merry Christmas. And the box came, oh I didn't even know see that one. Okay, so it came like, you know, Merry Christmas to you. There was a comb, there was also a an edge brush. I didn't even notice this was in there. I like them. An elastic band, which I have already sewn in. A wig cap, 18 inches. I got an 18 inch 360. 150% density, but you can do 180% density. I went ahead and bleached the knots myself in the front just with the Clairol Clay Bleach and Dirty Developer. And I also did sew in my elastic band. Also, their combs look like they did change in the back. They, get, they got a little bit wider. I really do like like the back of the nape to be really secure because I don't like to see it buckling in the back. This is like a tighter curl. If you guys remember, I did a wig for them like a few months ago and that wig was so pretty. Um, but this one is a little bit longer and the curl's a little bit tighter. So we're going to see how that goes. I already went ahead and took the, um, the legs off. So. I use this to Carol's daughter milk Carol hair milk it makes the Carol texture like different which kind of makes it greasy you, you really don't need a lot of it so I would just highly suggest if you use that don't use a lot the texture is pretty I told you guys you do not need 180 I mean but if you like your hair like really big like that for me this is like more than enough it's making me really hot it's a 360 so you can put it up in a bun if you want to or a ponytail you know just keep in mind that it's gonna be like a really thick one like a nice full one Girl, let me tell you, this wig is hot. Like, making me really hot right now. It's very full. I feel like the lion's mane. Like, serious. This is a lot of hair. Okay. Tell y'all something. As 
because I wore the wig throughout the day, like I really didn't have it on throughout the day. I had it on for like maybe like an hour after the video because I had to run out the house. I just realized that it was just really full and I was feeling like it was just so greasy feeling and I knew that that wasn't the hair texture. And it all goes back to me using the Carol's Daughter, okay, leave-in milk conditioner or hair milk moisturizing and conditioning. I have put enough of Carol's Daughter in the wig once I have rinsed the conditioner out. And I just let it air dry, okay? And I did this with like a few other units. I think like it all depends on the hair texture because I've noticed like when I do it to like another curly wig, which has kind of bigger curly curls, bigger curls, it doesn't give it that greasy feeling. It makes it manageable. For certain types of curls, you cannot always use Carol's Daughter, I noticed. Like it does give moisture, but sometimes it gives it a little bit too much moisture and it makes it look kind of greasy. And then it, the texture kind of changes. I rewashed the wig and take all the product out, air dry a little bit on its own. Then I just put in a little bit of this here, which is by Mark Anthony. And this is the Curl Defining Lotion. Then when I put the wig on, you know, and I had to just kind of like, you know, fix it up. I did notice that it was starting to kind of like dry out. I had to get my water bottle, which has, well, which had water and conditioner in it. Sprayed the wig down and just let it lay like for this particular wig, you don't want to kind of like put too much of a certain product in it. Like you don't want the product to have too much moisture in it or too much moisturizer in it because if it does, it will just make the wig really greasy. And then when you notice that, you know, like it's drawing out or whatever, it's like getting kind of like bigger and a little bit more drier, then get you a good water bottle with some conditioner in it. Put some water and some conditioner in it. You don't need a lot of conditioners and just spray that in the hair and just let it dry. The curls just changed a totally different dynamic once I washed it out and washed all of this out of it and then once I sprayed it out. So I wanted it to kind of be a little bit more tamed. And this happens to be one of my favorite, which is the Dark and Lovely. And this is the Natural uh, Moisture Lock. I've used this for quite a few years and this does not lay your hair down. It doesn't make it greasy. It is a moisture and it's a lock in ceiling cream, but it doesn't weigh it down and it doesn't make it greasy. I love Carol's Daughter, but not for every type of hair texture or hair um, curl. But overall experience, I'm glad that I did come back the next day and do this wig because girl, hunty, let me tell y'all, I was just like, oh, I don't really know about this. I mean, it's cute, but it's not like giving me like those wow vibes, like... It was hitting, but it wasn't hitting for me, like, you know what I'm saying? So I had to, like, do it all over. Like, it was hitting, but it was just, like, it, was, it wasn't it was even hitting. It was, like, more or less, like, smacking and punching. Like, I wanted to be hitting, not, like, knock me the hell out. You know what I'm saying? Overall experience, the wig actually turned out nice after that. You can get the wig either laced, you know, bleached knots or in the front a little bit or more so in the front. You have those options on rpghair.com definitely check them out i'm glad i did it over now you guys can tell me what you think which which styles did you like better the bigger shaka Khan or the just like i'm laid back chill style i love you guys stay deep and deep delicious make sure you rate comment subscribe thumbs this video up and i'll see you guys in a soon to come video peace